Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going to take a look on how to get a proper and working WhatsApp app on your iPad. Okay, a bit of context on why this video is happening. If you go to the App Store and you take a look and you type in WhatsApp, it is so hard to find a good WhatsApp app for the iPad. As it turns out, uh, you don't really require one. Just follow these steps, what I'm going to show you, and you can get WhatsApp on your iPad in less than 30 seconds. And without further ado, let's jump straight in. First, open up Safari on your iPad and head over to WhatsApp web. Now, go ahead and press the share icon on the top right hand corner on Safari. Scroll down and look for add to home screen. Go back to your home screen and you can now see the WhatsApp icon. Next, go ahead and log in. After you've already logged in and you can see that the list of messages and threads, all of your groups and whatever secret chats that you have already appeared on the window, you have now created a proper free WhatsApp on your iPad. Now, this is actually a shortcut. Uh, not an actual app, but this shortcut and because of iPad OS as well as mm, the Apple ecosystem and everything, uh, it does appear like an app and it does work like an app. If you go through the WhatsApp app from left to right and right to left, you can see everything is familiar. Whatever that appears on the WhatsApp app on your phone now appears here too. So awesome. You can now use WhatsApp on the iPad like you have been using it on your phone as well as on a desktop. So get ahead and uh, text people away just to test it out. All right, guys, that's it for the video. It's a short one, but I hope this has been helpful. If you have enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Hit the like button. If you're new to this channel, consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification button to be notified whenever I upload new videos. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.